Welcome to 7 Days Today, Day 31, 10.30pm. I'm at the roof of the Cracker Box. In the last episode, I managed to very slowly make my way back here. It was tough, and I'm out of bandages. I actually already backtracked to find some cloth, and I couldn't find any. The couches are made of leather, the curtains are made of plastic, and I see some nice loot on that building, but it's way too far for me to reach. So, there's a way back here to continue. It's night time, and I'm gonna endure and persist and try to be smart with my approach without bandages because nighttime in the desert it's not easy let's go let's go i got ammo kinda uh, i got a lot of 15 mil let's reload it 15 mil no uh, 9 mil i got shotgun let's see i got some peace and quiet here this might be a good place to fight okay so but it's also a really easy place to fall i already broke a leg in the last episode and uh, okay i'm just seeing delay i know i have to go here holy moly that's a lot of them okay but at least i can take a few shots this must be outside us there you go right on the leg oh i totally missed that one yeah let's at least deal with these ones because i think i have to go down yep <laughs> the ladder doesn't go up this weapon is fun but it sure takes a while to reload so getting an automated weapon like an AK would be great because with a scope I can use it as a, as a sniper but I have one of short shots but it's really hard to find weapons here no, not for 20 I might actually try to go for Lucky Looter too of course I'm not wearing the Lucky goggles I decided to just bring the nerdy glasses to save me some room because in the desert the loot is already good but it could be better God damn, what did I hit? What did I hit? Yeah, let's go for this one now, just to finish it off. There you go, they're done. These ones. I don't think this is gonna be all. No, no. My leg is almost cured. Uh, the health bar actually already went out, but I'm one minute and a half to go. Uh, I got a lot of uh, arrows, so I'm not gonna need more feathers now. And uh, yeah, I'm also out of food, as you can tell. I hopefully I'll find some, so let's take another coffee. At least it'll give me some hydration. And I'm just gonna wait for the leg to be cured to go down there. Yep. And let's wait because a few of them are still coming. I'm waiting for my leg to be cured because jumping also hurts me. I think. So if I can at least take a few of them out. And I'm actually gonna make a little bit more noise. See if more of them come. Because my leg is almost cured, my bike is over there. Yeah. 20 more seconds. And my leg is cured, which is a great help. But I'm gonna need bandages in case I start bleeding. So I'm definitely gonna have to look for cloth here. Let's see. I, he I think I hear a cop. Where are they? I hope this thing doesn't collapse. Holy moly. I'm stepping on a cop. Sorry, cop. I stepped on your face. <laughs> okay. Let's see what we got. Okay. Apparently there's a few of them sleeping. This cop cover come from the outside. I have a feeling that the spawn... Oh yeah. Let's go up. I think a few of them are gonna come. Let's see. Nice. Down you go. Down you go. Thank you. Anybody else? Let's reload them. Oh, that guy is dead. Nice. Oh, a bandage. Sweet. That was lucky. And some nice ammo. Oh, that was great. That was a good, a good, a good lucky find. Okay, let's go down again. That bandage could be a lifesaver. Is there more dogs? This is a totally different level, and I think it's higher up. There they are. There's a dog. Where's the dog? Is he in here? There's a dog. Oh, how did this bag? 
Oh, and another bandage. Nice. <laughs> that was lucky. Just pick everything. Oh, is this the running shoes? Oh, baby. Stamina regen and running. There we go. Sorry, sorry, protective boots. I'm going to have to uh, wear the running shoes. They're just... Oh, I've been looking for them. They give me stamina regen while I'm running. Okay, lady. There you go. Thank you. Where's the others? There's a stupid dog down there. Right on the face. Right on the neck. And down goes the Pucci. Nice. And uh, yeah, we can't close any of these doors. Which makes it a little bit scarier. Well, let's continue. Let's continue. That was a lucky find. The bandages. So, yeah. I think these don't give me cloth, do they? Oh, they do! Oh, man! I thought they gave leather. I actually just look at the cultures, I didn't try them out. That was a mistake. Okay, so they give cloth. Nice. Good thing to know. Some glue. Nice. Okay, so, yeah. Still not a single bookshelf. Uh, that's concerning. The cracker book should be hard. I agree. Should be hard. It is hard. At least so far. Uh, but it should also have uh, bookshelves. Uh, that's how I feel about it. Because otherwise, what's the point of coming here? I really hoped that there's gonna be some really awesome loot. There's an opening here. Should I go this way? So I came this way. There's not a clear way down. So I guess it must be through that window. Let's see if there's another way. As you can tell, all the bullet. Yeah, I could go this way, but I don't think this is the path. I don't think this is the path. I'm not supposed to do the jump that way, I don't think so. Yeah, I think it's definitely through this window. It's weird, looks like it's going down. And I just X them, didn't I? This is where I came in. No? Yeah, this is where I came in and I totally didn't see... Oh, maybe this was actually the entrance. Or oh, they broke this window. Yeah, they broke this window. Because this this is where I climbed up. But I went there and went up. So I don't think this was open. So where should I go now? That's a good question. So I definitely feel like this must be the way. Uh, yeah, even though it didn't look like it. It just... There's no way back. And the way is definitely down. So let's go down. Yeah, I couldn't find any other way. Continue. Uh, yep. So that's the thing. I do have some nice mods here. Let's see if I can put them somewhere else. No, that's the boot thing. I already got a three. I got a three. Okay, I can put on this one. Uh, I'm gonna lose, of course, uh, some pack box pockets. Because I had two here, but that's fine. Uh, when I get the chance to do threes and get better armor and stuff, I got pockets in all the clothes. So that's right. So let's actually put this thing here. And I might actually sell these boots because the running shoes are just awesome. Holy moly. Yeah, there's a lot of them and there's nowhere for me to go. Uh, let's make a way for me to go. Holy moly, they're already here. Yep. Let's go win them. Did you guys come from the outside? Let's get the spider zombie before he breaks me another leg. That's a tough one, isn't it? There's another one. That's why it was tough. It was actually two. I'm not even seeing where I'm going at. Okay, but I think the worst is best. These ones are actually a little bit injured. And they're not feral. Okay. There we go. Okay, nice. And uh, let's actually take one pill instead of the bandage. There you go. So there are the bookshelves right here. 
But these are not the good ones. This is probably going to be just paper. Most of them. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, boy. The real bookshelves, you know? Oh, that one I can sell. Okay. And did they clear a path for me? Yes, so I can go to the bike. That's great. Nothing here. Yeah, that's a little disappointing. So I came from there, so I guess he continues downstairs. So let's just snoop around. Okay, I can take lead. Some money. There you go. Not real dukes, but... Okay. So I guess the basement is gonna be where all hell breaks loose. So you're coming from here too? You came from the outside. Oh, they broke this door. Goddamn zombies. This one is not the smartest one. Okay, but I do have a door that I can close here. So let's just see this box. Yeah, but the zombies doing 200% damage, they break doors like, like, really easily. <laughs> Couldn't think of a good analogy, but that's okay. I'm actually gonna drop these electrical parts and this dirty water. Let's have a nice beer. I don't get buzzed. I found that book. And uh, I think we're done here. Yep. Let's just keep going. leave the paper I'm not interested I can take some lead let's make some more cobble there you go I got some more room when the morning comes this will slow down a little bit this is still a lot of them coming from the outside final sounds on all the time it's just what it happens so I really think that, yeah, look at that, they totally broke this wall. That's, <laughs> that's how it goes. Oh, it's a soldier. But it's not a fair one. That one is a fair one. Nice. I'm thirsty. Okay. So let's have some coffees. I don't have anything else to drink today. Nope. Let's just have coffee. That's fine. Works just fine. Gives me stamina regen. I mean, I'm already uh, sexy Saurus 4. But even so, it helps. Because of the running. Because I think... Uh, I think this, this part is all done. I really do. So let's keep going. I got another door here. Oh boy. This doesn't look good. Where are they? One in the fat guy. This is a feral. Yep. Now goes the feral. Another feral. Let's close the door. There you go. Holy moly. That's a biker. Okay. Let's see if a few of them fall on the spikes. It has a dog too. Holy moly. Where to go? I don't know. Oh Jesus, that's a eh, oh and green ones and shit. Let's go outside. Let's drive around a little bit. How about that? Let's just go around the, the, the perimeter. Yep. Let's use another bandage. God damn, that was close. <laughs> oh nice, there's a path here. I wasn't sure. Okay, but at least I got some time to think, to put a bandage, and to find my way back. And there's a Pucci. And I just ran him over. And it's daytime. Okay, I think it was a good idea. Can I hit him? I'm not sure. Very laggy. Holy bully. I might have to go back. Oh, Jesus. What the hell is this? There's more zombies here than during Horde Nights. That's not good. Let's go for another ride. I think it must be better. There's a bag here. And there's few zombies on this side. Maybe not. Maybe I should go back to the bike. Yeah, I think it's better. Let's go for the front. The front looked like much better. Let's run over this Pucci. 
and let's try to take him out. God damn, it's really hard to hit something, you know? Okay, at least the Pucci is out. Now a little bit far from my bike. Look at that thing. What the hell is going on? It, it, it really needs to have like 13 ammo boxes inside. To make up for all of this. <laughs> it didn't hit me in the back. I'm surprised. Let's get rid of those ferals. Jesus. At least this fat guy is a little bit slower. Let's go back again. Oh man, I really need to bring explosives the next time around. Yep. This is this is just ridiculous. This is just something else. And uh, probably a few of them from the outside, of course. They hear the noise. They know something's amiss, and they come to investigate. Is this a good way to go? Holy moly, this is not a good way to go. Oh, my driving skills paid off. Nice. Oh, not so much. Goddamn, don't. Oh, but at least I don't have any injuries. Okay. I mean, in a line. Nice. Nobody behind me. Okay. Jesus, that's... I should have run, but good thing he missed. Nice, the fat guy is out in the nurse too. There you go. Yeah, let's keep this strategy. Few shots, few melees. And uh, that's a fair. I do have uh, a feral thing on, on me and my weapons, and I do have a shotgun too. I think that was a good time to use a shotgun. God damn, I, I messed up my buttons there. Let's drink another coffee. Okay. It's like Horde Night out on the street. I used to do this all the time. But I was a little bit better prepared with meds and shit. Should I go for barrels? Yeah, let's go up to the bridge. Nice, another feral. Jesus, the big boys are still here. What if I make my way back to the crack? Okay. Let's see if they find their way. I, let's see if I find my way, because I'm not sure where the cracker book is now. I think it's somewhere over here. Let's take some bones. There we go. Oh, much less people on this side. This one's actually lost me, I think. Nice workout. Great. Okay, look at it. Much less zombies here. <clears throat> I have a feeling they'll find a way. Yeah, like this. But maybe not all of them, you know? Maybe that wasn't a terror. Yeah, maybe all of them. <laughs> the fat guy jiggles, the fat guy goes down. Thank you. Just right click my way to victory. There we go. Now you're not so tough. When you come in once, much easier. I'm gonna get the dogs though. Yes. I want the bones. I don't know. Maybe it's an addiction. Because I already got a lot of bones and duct tape in blue. But I want to still build stuff. So I think it's a good idea. Since I'm not using knife. I gotta collect a lot of them. Okay. I think there was a still a few more back on this side. Let's see. There's these bones here too. Let's take them right now. Before I forget. There's just a nice quantity. And uh, it seems like a few of them must have forgot. I saw bikers. There were still a few fat ferals. And I think most of them... No, look at that. Let's just run through them. Doesn't work very well. It slows down the bike like, like no other. But it's a little bit thinned out, the horde. The bike is a little bit stronger. Yeah, and I'm... 
Where did you come from? Holy moly, he almost killed me. Jesus. I got... Oh, they're coming right through the building, aren't they? I got a little bit greedy there. Gotta use more bullets with these fellas. These are warrior big fellas. They're not as easy as, as, as the nomad big fellas. I can definitely use melee, but I should smooth them out first, you know? Like this. Take some damage out of them. There you go, still not done. Now he's done. Okay, man. This took a while. Is that all? I sure hope so. So this pack lasted a while, which is nice. Let's see. Oh, great. Oh, military armor schematic. Nice. That's something that I'm going to have to work towards. Definitely. And let's actually empty out some stuff. Let's drop this. This books I'll sell later. This money, I'm probably going to find more. So one spring. I'm going to scrap it. What does it give? I think maybe iron. One spring. I didn't bring the wrench, so I'm not going to wrench anything. So the skull crushers. Now there's not much points. Is there? <laughs> I had the skull crushers and I totally forgot about it. Okay, so let's just uh, get back inside. And hopefully most of them are clear. Let's see about that. Do I have some more meds? I used up all the pills. Yeah, man. That's not good. And I don't have any food. Yeah. Let's see. I think it was down here. They, I left the door open. So is this clear? I think it must be. Let's see what we got. And this door is open. Did they break it? I think they broke the damn door. Because this was, this thing was off. Yeah. That's just how it goes. I missed that. Really? There you go. Okay. Well, let's just see the load. Uh, I should... Yeah, if I break this, it's gonna fall, isn't it? Yeah. I do have any eye candy. Since I forgot to use the skull crushes, let's at least try to use the eye candy. So I gotta go here. There's more folks. Okay, gotcha. I thought it was all. Apparently not. Yeah, let's fight against the wall. There you go. A nice line. Let's just see what we, what, what we got to loot. That's a big bathroom. Jesus, look at the amount of room we got in here. That's incredible. So, oh, this goes even further. There's a weapons bag. There's another ladder going up. This, I think it must have been zombies digging up. This must be for a quest, definitely. I, ha I have that feeling. And there's the big loot. Okay. So let's open up this baby first. Let's see. Uh, 41 lockpicks. Let's give it a go. Still on the second one. This one is working out. Great. So let's see. Do I have to break stuff? Yeah. There's a few boxes to break. And let's try to use the air candy on all of this. And I hear more. Could be above me. But I think it's just one. Okay, so let's just close this door. And let's take the candy. I actually only brought one. Yeah, I thought I had two. No. Okay, let's see. Nice. I can do the, the, the elixir, elixir for XP. Let's wait. Let's see the ammo. Awesome. I'm actually going to scrap it. Because I have a pile of lead and breasts. Nice. That was good. I actually need one of these. There you go. More than one, isn't it? Yep. It's apparent. Nice. And now I have no door. Okay. Let's just see. There was another box up here. There it is. Coffee beans. Great. I can do coffee. And now I can do the beans too. Thank you. 
That's great. Still not sure if it... Uh, pay oh, maybe. Auto turret. Oh, that's great. That's great because I definitely want to use auto turrets in my whole base. Uh, I didn't bring any repair. I did. There they are. I got two. This steel armor. I'm going to sell. I'm going for light armor. But that was awesome. That was awesome. I'm going to keep it this way and open up later to save me some room. So let's see. Let's see what else we got. This room is done. Nice, some duct tape. There's also another book here in the middle. Let's open up here before I forget. Cracker book. Grandpa's moonshine. I'm not sure what the moonshine does. I think... Yeah, I don't remember. I don't remember what the moonshine does. So this one is broken. Let's see some coffee. Coffee beans. There you go. Of course, I'm not specced into the farmer. So I'm not going to be able to take a lot out of the farming that's a big old machine god damn must wash a lot of clothes never seen that model before looks pretty cool oh in a military oh baby this is light armor isn't it yeah let's fix this oh wait, i can't now it's a good time to actually start using the mods Gonna have to craft a few mods for stamina, for noise. Noise not so much, but for stamina. And mobility, definitely. Because now with mi mi military armor, that's gonna be nice. So I'm actually gonna eat this too. I'm kinda hungry. And there you go. And let's see. There was a weapons bag somewhere. This is where I came in, isn't it? Was this where I came in? Looks different. I didn't see that. No, this is not where I came in. I'm not sure what this is. This is not where I came in. No, no. Oh, yeah. Let's see the weapons back. Okay, a couple mods. And let's see. Where does this go? This is also not where I came in. But I don't think there's anything up here. Okay, so let's keep going. I don't think I got it all, so I went into the bathroom. Let's keep going left. I came here. Is that all? That's the big loot. There's that one over there. Ooh, urban book. You always land silently unless you are taking damage and jump height is not reduced. Great, so it's gonna help with sneak. AP44. Not too bad. Okay, so I guess that's all. Nothing back there. This is where I came in. Yeah, the staircase. So I guess that's all. Let's just see if there's a hidden box. I still got 58 seconds. Where would be the hidden stash in this building? There, there's a lot of places where it could be, right? It's going to be really tricky to find it. But that was great. Uh, it was fun. Not sure if it paid off. I did find some good stuff. But I think it should have more loot. At least more cracker book boxes. Because this was really hard. I managed to not die. But it was definitely very hard. Let's see if I can do some more cobble. I can't. So let's just drop all of this in the bike. And I think I'm going to bring this cloth. I really thought this was leather. Yeah. But this cloth is going to be very useful. And uh, back at the outpost, I should have more meds. So let's drop some stuff on the bike and see what that bundle had. Because I'm really curious. So let's drop this. It's going to be off for sailing. I got this nice mod, but I can't put it in for now. But I can do military armor. So let's see. Maybe I can put it here. No, this is a full auto mod. I can't have an auto, uh, a hunting rifle full auto. No, no. So let's open it up. Two SMG auto turrets and a bunch of ammo, 9mm. That was great, man. That was real lucky. I'm going to put him in my whole base. And these two turrets are probably going to be for bird control. I think I'm going to put him on the roof. And inside, I'm probably going to use more shotgun auto turrets. But that was great. That was a good find. So I'm going to be able to do a little bit of money. 
And after this, I think I'm gonna... Well, day 32. Hmm, let me think. So it took me like a full day. I kind of started on 31 uh, in the middle of the afternoon, I think. So it kind of took me almost 24 hours. So the Dishong is much bigger. I think the Dishong is gonna take longer. And I still have a few things to do in the Horde base. But it's pretty much done. So maybe, just maybe, I can go for the shotgun. Or I can go for these smaller POIs that I haven't gone into. Look, there's a popping pills. There's an electronic stuff. This could be a cool thing. I think this should be all one POI. All these buildings here. There's also a shotgun messiah back there. So there's plenty to go to. Definitely for now. I'm gonna go back to the outpost, unload some stuff, and go to the trailer to sell a few things too. And I should also look for some vending machines. I didn't mark a single one. I thought I did. The Shong Vets, Shotgun Messiah Tier 4. I already done those. So I didn't mark a single vending machine, but I see one there. Let's see if there. Oh, it's not a vending machine. It's one of these things. Is it open? No. I already collected the money. Okay. That was fruitful. The cracker book cracked me up, and not in a good way, but it's done. Thank you for watching, and until next time.